Hi again, everybody. Wayne DeZue back here on Sports Radio 630thefan.com. Lots of sports to talk about. Let's start with Boise State. Their football team's got an open scrimmage tonight. Public is free, and I'll tell you what, will they decide a quarterback? Uh, who knows? Uh, it could change with any series. Ryan Finley continues to be the leading candidate there, but we'll see what happens tonight. And of course, Boise State opens up the regular season two weeks from tonight as they host the University of Washington. How about the Boise Hawks? You know, they took that long bus ride from Boise over to Hillsboro and then got off the bus and scored four runs in the first inning and beat the division-leading Hillsboro Hops by a score of 5-3 to three last night. Two teams play there again tonight. Idaho football coach Paul Petrino has apologized. Uh, he, You know, there was a reporter up there in Moscow who said that uh, Petrino had to be restrained because he didn't like some questions that was being asked of him. Well, Petrino uh, got with the press and apologized to the reporter, said he didn't have to be restrained, but he did use an unprofessional tone and reacted poorly. And, of course, the Idaho Vandals open up their season two weeks from last night against Ohio. That is a Thursday night game on the 3rd right here on 630 The Fan. Also, let's talk about the Boise Hawks. Well, forget the Boise Hawks. We already talked about them. The Idaho Steelheads have re-signed Brad Colton. Uh, Colton was one of the three players that played for the Steelies last year that has re-signed. Uh, he actually had a great season. He scored 49 points in 65 games. And he was also named the unsung hero for the uh, Steelies after scoring 28 points in 28 games following the All-Star break. And uh, former Boise State quarterback Kellen Moore did not have a great night last night in a 21-17 loss to the Washington Redskins. Uh, Kellen Moore was out there not too much, but he's, he had three of seven passes for 31 yards is all as he fights for the number two quarterback position with the Detroit Lions. I'm Wayne DeZubak, and that's it for me right here on Sports Radio 630thefan.com.